were engaged in in the early months of 2007, Hillary Clinton and Joe Biden immediately offered a resolution to kill it. Hillary Clinton joined on, Ted Kennedy joined on, Barack Obama joined on. They failed by a few votes. Then they tried to pull the appropriations out from under it, like we'd done in Vietnam. It failed by a few votes. And by September, General Petraeus came in and said, the doggone thing is working. Violence is down 80%. And that's a tax on Americans and a tax between Sunnis and Shiites and the doggone government standing up. So we won this war in Iraq. And President Obama had no interest when he came in in 2009. We had fewer Americans killed in Iraq in 2009 when he took over than were killed in his hometown of Chicago by a factor of two. The war was over. That's what we did. We won the war. We did it not just with American weapons. We did it with American character. And uh, and I just leave you with one last thing. You know, there was one little town called Sacloia that was north of Fallujah, and I thought it was one of the greatest stories of the war. There was a it was a tough town, an Al Qaeda town. They held on to it for a long time. They had we had a little marine outpost there, made out of sandbags, it was about 20 feet by 20 feet, 12 Marines in it. There was an Iraqi family that lived across the street, and they had a little girl. The little girl played next to the outpost every day in the square. One day, Al-Qaeda ran a suicide truck at it and blew it. They blew the outpost down. Marines came crawling out with blood coming out of their ears, their clothes half ripped off. But when the medics came over to treat them, they pushed them out of the way. They wouldn't accept medical help. They ran over and tried to revive the little girl who had been hit by the blast. They worked on her for two hours. They brought the medevac and medevac, she and her family, to the Marine Surgical Unit, and she died. But two days later, all the leaders of this tough town who had formerly been with Al-Qaeda came in and saw the Americans and said, we're on your side now. Because we saw what the Americans did when that little girl was hit. We see that you are much different than Al-Qaeda and we're fighting on your side against them. We're going to help exterminate them. And they did. And within a few weeks, they exterminated Al-Qaeda in this tough town, this dark city of Anbar province called Sacramento. That's how we won the war in Iraq. And, and, uh, and incidentally, I've got about 150 Silver Star winners in this book, but i got one offer I make to everybody, because this is my shtick. I am peddling these books just like a lot of my fellow uh, peddlers out here with the, with the table. So it's a lot of fun to sell things to you guys in today. And, uh, and I do charge 20 bucks for the book. However, if you have an active duty military guy in your family or who is a friend, I will sign a book over to them complimentary. That's what we do wherever we go. So if you've got somebody, a uh, grandson or son or daughter or niece or nephew or a friend who's in the active duty military today, come over and see me and I've got a book for them. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you. Thanks for letting me